Yo, it's your boy Dre Dunn, and I'm a Lakers fan, you know. And uh, it's just a shame, man. We can't even fucking suck in peace. We can't even suck in peace. Um, as as a lot of people may know, um, uh, Nick Young, who plays for the Lakers, and comes off the bench for us. For us, um, he's dating uh, the rapper Iggy Azalea. Her music is fucking trash. He's dating her. It's not. This is not what that video is about, though. Um, D'Angelo Russell, our rookie, our future of our fucking franchise. He taped Nick Young admitting to pursuing and sleeping with other women. He, he recorded this with his phone. And not just recorded the audio. I'm talking video. You can see Nick Young laying down. And they're just ha casually having a conversation about women he's been with. And... And I know what all the dudes gonna say, who, 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 all the dudes, we gonna say, that's the snitch move, uh, he a snitch, you can't trust nobody like that, and, and I 100% agree, um, I just, it is, I'm telling you, this, uh, you remember I made that Vince Staples video, the same people that say, oh, none of these hip hop is trash, you know, I like Vince Staples, I like Vince Staples too, but, uh, they think like Vince Staples, none of these hip hop is trash, and, I like the new shit. And I like to get lit and listen to Future and get turned. Those are the same niggas that snitch ass, bitch ass, new ass niggas that'll snitch on you. Ain't got no type of guy code or nothing. Bitch ass niggas that'll snitch on you. D'Angelo Russell, a bitch ass nigga for that shit. But, this is what we have got to think about. Nick Young isn't right either. And I don't know what, and I don't understand like, and I understand, man, we, we like fucking women. We like fucking... It's like Eddie Murphy said on an old comedy, uh, on uh, Eddie Murphy Raw. Men, it is... I, I, we just feel... A lot of men, we're on this planet to conquer as much pussy as we can. And that's just how men's... Um, that's how our, our mindset is. But it's fucked up that we are in relationships. Why are you in a relationship where you just want to go and run through a bunch of chicks? Just run through a bunch of chicks. Don't be in a fucking relationship. Why is Nick Young cheating on Iggy in the first place? I mean, um, why? Why are you even with her in the first place if you're going to cheat on her? You can't just throw, oh, I cheated. It's like, I fucking shot eight people. Why you snitched on me? You shouldn't have fucking shot eight people, dumbass. You shouldn't have cheated on Iggy. And a lot of dudes you just... We fucked up in the mind. We just think, oh, our cheating is just cool. Us cheating on a chick is just cool. We think that shit is just normal. And um, that's just a fucked up mindset that a lot of men have. Um, but this is just sad. The Lakers can't even fucking suck in, in, in peace. We can't even just have our shitty season, try to get our draft pick, try to get Ben Simmons, Met Kobe, have his farewell tour, and wave in front of the last couple of crowds and walk off in the sunset with Vanessa and the kids. We can't even do that shit. Because motherfuckers is, is out their mind. We got these lame ass dudes playing for us, man. This is why I told y'all as we should have drafted Jaleel Okafor. All you motherfucking Laker fans, when, when D-Lo scored 38 and y'all was coming at me saying, Oh, yeah, you said we should have drafted Okafor. Yeah, Okafor would never fucking snitch. I'm just... <laughs> I'm glad we drafted D-Lo. I still like Okafor. We might have a chance to get Okafor with the Sixers wanting to get rid of him. But um, this is fucking sad. Do we? This is this is bad though for D-Lo because his teammates aren't gonna be able to trust him. And that's not even just cheating. It's just anything. Like when you do snake shit like this, it's just hard for anyone to trust you. Um. Man, till next time, man. Dre done. Peace. Lakers, stop this fuck shit.